So here's how you can set up your own free dedicated server in Palworld so you can play with up to 32 people. First off, the easiest way to do this is through the Palworld dedicated server tool. So head over to Steam and enable the tools checkbox first and then the Palworld dedicated server should appear after downloading Palworld. Now before you launch it, you may want to configure your server settings first. So right click on the Palworld dedicated server, click manage and then click on browse local files. This should open the game files. Next up, navigate to the Palworld folder, click on saved, click on config, and then click on windows server, and finally open the powerword settings.ini file. Here you can set things like the exp rate, difficulty, and so much more. Normally you can adjust the difficulty of the world while creating your server in the game, however this is not available for dedicated server creations, so this is the only way for now. Once you are happy with the settings you have tweaked, remember to save it, and then after that head over to steam once again to launch the powerword dedicated server option. If you see this black window pop up, it means that your server is now up and running and you and your friends can now join in. Remember that you need to keep this application on for your server to be online, otherwise nobody could join your server. Now, how do you actually join the server? It is pretty easy. If you are the host of the server, simply find out what your IP address is first. You can do so by searching for network in your PC, click on properties, and your IPv4 address should appear right here. And all you need to do now is to open the main Palworld game, select join multiplayer in the game, paste your IP address right below here followed by the port 8211 and you should join in without any issues. Now if you want your friends or other people to join, you need to share your public IP address instead. Your public IP address is very easy to find as well as all you need to do is to head over to whatismyip.com and your public IP should appear under the my public IPv4. Copy this IP address and share to whoever that wants to join your server and all they need to do now is to paste it in here as usual followed by the port A211 again. Now if other people cannot join your server, you have to make sure to port forward your router first, otherwise no one could join you. In order to port forward your router, I'd highly suggest to search for a guide based on your router but to keep it simple, there should be a port forwarding option in your router settings and all you need to do now is to port forward 8211. Let me know if you have any questions below and I'll try to help out as much as I can.